And now for our application. This is going to be a fun one. We have 69 out of 100. And we wrote it as 69% on our daily ticker. And it also is the same thing as 69 hundredths. So when we will go to simplify, I told you always go and use your toolbox and start if you don't know out of, off the top of your head. Now, looking at 69, I can go off the top of my head and I know I can divide 6 by 3 and 9 by 3. And if I divide 6 by 3, it goes 2 times. And if I divide 9 by 3, it goes 3 times. But let's suppose you don't have that knowledge because you haven't been teaching fifth grade for 27 years and are an ancient person. But you go and you listen to what Mr. Hosha said of using your toolbox. And your first set of the toolbox are your first set of prime numbers uh, to divide into. Now we know two is not going to go into nine because in order for a number to be divisible by two, it has to end in two, four, six, eight, or zero. So my next prime number is three. So we take 69 and we divide it by three and it goes two times. Okay, so we have three, 23 and 69. But wait a minute, even though I found there's a fact, those factors are any of those common factors with 100? And the answer is no, there is no common factor between 69 and 100. So it is in its simplest form. How fun is that?